now we have a heart line from Sadie in New Zealand. Dear Master, August 2023 marked the fifth anniversary of my father's liberation from this physical world. He was diagnosed with terminal cancer and was given three months to live. I knew that my father was deeply saddened by the news. However, he told us not to cry and turn to his Buddhist faith or strength. He meditated every day and visited the temple regularly until he was physically unable to do so. As I walked home one evening after visiting my father, an inner voice told me to return with a picture of Master. I brought back a pendant with Master's photo and hung it on the wall behind him. On the foot of his bed, he had a picture of the Buddha so that he could look at it for strength. I did not know that it would be the last time I would see my father alive. Early in the morning, after 1am, my father woke up and saw bright light surrounding him. He called my mother, who was looking after him at the time, to look at the Buddha light radiating from the Buddha's picture. The light was so bright that he thought it was daytime and asked for the blinds to be opened so he could look out into his treasured garden. My father passed away peacefully in his sleep an hour later. Knowing that Master appeared as Buddha during my father's final hour to bring him to a heavenly realm lessened our grief of his passing. A few days after his death, he appeared to my younger sister in a dream and told her that Master is the one. During my older sister's attendance, at the International Retreat in Taiwan, or Formosa, in December 2019, my father appeared to my mother in a dream and told her that he was going to a new land. We did not understand the significance of his words until my sister returned to share the joyful news that Master had elevated all relatives of those who had attended the retreat to the new realm, Tim Kortu Land. Master, we can never thank you enough for your unconditional love and blessings. I love you, Master, and will follow and serve you for all eternity. May you always be protected by all the gods and godses in the universe. Your humble and devoted disciple, Sadie from New Zealand. Faithful Sadie, thank you for your heart line. Master would like to send a heartfelt message to you. Filial Sadie, thank you for sharing your story of your father's passing from this world into the glorious heavens. Surely it will bring many disciples peace that their relatives are truly taken care of by the master power and can be elevated along with them. May you and the confident people of New Zealand rise into oneness with divine origin and enjoy heavenly grace forever. Embracing you with love. Vegan Leader, Evan's Beloved Leader We welcome your hearts lines, stories and or cute loving animal people clips. Please send them via suprememastertv.com forward slash hotline.